Ina iwi i hui hui nei. Tina koto, tina koto, tina koto katoa. Greetings. I'm Ian and Zhao from Lincoln University in Christchurch, New Zealand. Thank you for joining me today for an update on Lincoln's journey with supporting open access publishing. Just a quick recap: journals at Lincoln is published using OJS. It provides an A publishing platform for Lincoln University editors to host open access journals. DOAJ inclusion. There are many benefits of DOAJ indexing. I won't go into details today. It has already been covered by a couple of excellent webinars, which I have listed here for your reference. I'm sure today's keynote speech will be an excellent resource resources as well. For my presentation, I wanted to look at how we increased the visibility of our journal's content by uploading journal articles metadata to DOAJ. After successful DOAJ inclusion, we can then upload article metadata to DOAJ. DOAJ make the metadata available openly and publicly. It also makes it available to commercial discovery systems such as OCLC, Xlibre products, Web Science, Scopus, and so on. This is one of the main draw cut for us.、Uh, we see this as a、um, great opportunity for us to increase the visibility, accessibility of our journal's content with minimum effort from our end. We have already uploaded one of our journal's metadata to DOAJ in April this year. So far, I have already seen metadata from OCLC's WorldCat, from universities' catalogs for those universities that are using Xlibre's products, and in Google and Google Scholar. I haven't seen any metadata、um, available in one of those from the big commercial database yet. Such as Web of Science and Scopus, the OAG did advise us that it could take more than six months for records to show up in those big commercial systems. I will definitely check again later this year. How to upload metadata? There are three methods:、um, using API, or upload XML files, or you could also enter article metadata manually. You can find more informations about those three methods from DOAJ's website. For us, we used API method with an OJS plugin. So first, we obtained the an API key from DOAJ by log into our DOAJ's account and then go to dashboard and then settings. Because our journals are hosted within OJS system. Uh, once we obtain the API key, we then log into OJS as journal manager, and then go to Tools, and then Import, Export, and then click on the OJ Export plugin. Under the Setting tab, enter the OJ API key, and then tick OJS will deposit article automatically to the OJ, and then click Save. If there's no issue. That's all you need to do. Of course, depends on your setup. There could be issues.、Uh, for us, we learned that we need to make sure the ASN number entered in OJS is the same as the one registered in ASN portal. If the they are not the same for whatever reasons, then you're going to run into a mismatch error. We also learned. That the easiest way to check metadata uploads has been successful is to go to the OAJ website and then navigate to your journal listing page and then check under the articles tab. If you require further help, I found there's a lot of really useful informations from the OAJ website.、Uh, we were also able to get help from the OAJ help desk and KPK client support. That's the end of my presentation.、Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to get in touch. Thank you.